We're getting ready to take off and uh, we have to go down this little like uh, four wheel drive trail. And there's a road down there that's actually closed, but it's a dirt road, got some really bad washouts. I just saw at least a dozen cars or trucks go through there, like SUVs and stuff. So I wonder what they're up to. We're gonna find out like, maybe, because we're gonna go down there, we're gonna go back that way, and we're gonna check out that mine shaft on the way out uh, as, before we head over to the rest area. <laughs> You see it? <laughs> what we have here is a rare desert tortoise. Hey, little buddy. How you doing, huh? How you doing, little buddy? You see he's got the dirt on his back. I'm not getting any closer, don't worry. Uh, got the dirt on his back because they live in holes, just like an old groundhog. Uh, what they'll do is they'll dig back into dirt banks where there's some sandy stuff and they'll dig a big hole back in the bank and crawl back in there and spend their days when it's really hot out here this is uh, uh october and it'll get to 100 degrees even now the summer is like 120s like all the time so he's probably got a burrow around here somewhere and that's probably where he's headed and uh we'll let him go Boy, I just don't see very many of these guys. See a lot of dead ones, but not very many live ones. I'm not gonna worry, <laughs> worry about moving him off the road. Back east when we get like box turtles, eastern box turtles or terrapins on the road, a lot of times, you know, if it's a busy road, uh, people will, and I'll do the same if it's safe. Uh, if they see a turtle in the road, get them out, you know, move them to the other side where he was headed because cars hit them all the time. I don't know if they do it on purpose or they just don't, uh, you know, see the little turtle in the road, but that's a major uh, way that they get killed nowadays is by automobiles. So if you ever do that, please, please be very careful about other vehicles coming around corners and running you over. I know my wife, uh, I was with my wife one time and she uh, wanted to do that. She just jumps out, hey, get the turtle out. She almost got killed. I'm like, you know, I have actually passed by turtles, uh, tortoises now when it, they're on like sharp bends and stuff because it's not worth losing your life. Um, so just be really careful when you move them out of the road. I'm not gonna worry about him. I'm the only vehicle that's been up this road as far as I know in the last, you know, since I got here. shaft right up in here let's go ahead and look at that on our way out i didn't bring the drone with me because i know i'm not gonna have enough time today because i really want to get down to the rest area but let's go check out this mine shaft I'm pretty sure it's right down this road i can tell no one's been in here in a long time though no uh prints at all Like I said, I was only here the one time, so I, 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 I gotta be a little careful. <laughs> I don't wanna run in that thing. Pretty sure it's right up here though. This is actually a gold mine back in the day. Some hints of some prints right there. They've been rained on really hard though. Take a shaft off. No, it's not it. Off to our left, but there's a mine shaft over. You can't see it very well, but there's a mine shaft over there. We'll look at that too when we have time. And I do not remember being back this far. We must not be on the right place. Maybe they filled it in. <laughs> That'd be weird. Yeah, this isn't it. Isn't that weird? 
Another mine shaft over there. We'll look at it later too. No, not it. Wow, that's weird. Tell you what. We can buy a bunch of mine shafts, but that's not the one that she wanted me to check. Uh, we saw, saw two of them at least. So I think I went and buy it. We'll, we'll look around for a little bit more on the way out. That's uh, Interstate 40 right there. You can see the trucks parked along. That's one of those exits I want to check parked along there. So let's go ahead and zip up there for now. So I want to uh, I want to look around the rest area before it gets really hot today. And uh, we're definitely <laughs> lollygagging. I can feel the sun already. It's really baking me. anyone these are all the vehicles that went by my campsite I think I got a shot of them they must be doing the Mojave Trail which is a um, four-wheel die trail it's really long yeah, and this is part of it, and then it goes up in the mountains that way. I'll show you where. This is the way to travel, though. Let's go. I don't know if I can get up to 55. If you look down that way, about halfway to the next mountains, the, you know, where the mountains go up again, that's where the rest area is. So that's where we're headed. These guys are going to cut off up that way, which we might go check out for a campsite later on. I don't know if we can get good cell signal up there, though. We'll let them go by. This is Route 66, where you get your kicks. I talked about it coming out here a little bit. Um, this was the... The original way to get across country to the west from the east coast before they built the interstate system eisenhower president eisenhower was responsible for that i do believe um, and one of the reasons was that using a road like this as a major artery to move uh military equipment in case we're ever invaded by like japan uh, or anybody like that you know would be a disaster as far as uh, being able to get tanks and tracks and all kinds of stuff cross country so they built these interstate systems uh, partly to help with that situation at least that's what i've read let's get going i always look in your mirror getting off on the uh, Mojave Trail. Let's pull over here for a second. I want to show you something. Oh, yeah. Stretch my legs a bit. This is a good area to show you a couple things. That's the uh, that's National Wildlife Preserve over there. And you can drive up and stay, as long as you stay on the trails, marked roads, you can drive all the way up through there. You can camp up there. No metal detector, no gold hunting, but you can hike, do whatever else you want. If you look across the valley, down in the bottom there, right between those two posts, that's the rest area we're going to, and that we're gonna explore, you know, hike up and down the valley, probably just on this side, since supposedly this is the direction they were headed. Uh, to look for any clues. And that's Interstate 40. That's a troll train in the God, look how long this thing is. That's a troll train. You can see the cars start there. Man, they go way off into the distance. Well, maybe there's two separate trains. If you look at that mountain up there, just to the left of the telephone pole, that has the tower on the cell tower that we were looking at earlier this morning. And we we're actually camped on the other side of that. So we've driven this whole distance. 
this is kind of neat because this is route 66 and it's a closed section so you <laughs> you never see vehicles on it <laughs> um but today we did all right shall we we might take a spin up there later on today just to see what's up there oh there is a really there's a yeah okay yeah 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 <laughs> I'll quit talking now. My mind's going a mile a minute, you know what I mean? Oh, looky. <laughs> Like we have a troll train around the bend she's a coming <laughs> again this is actually closed so there's not too much traffic so i think we can park in, park in the middle of the road up off of that thing wow well you can see it if you look above the engines you can see how it's all wavy that's the hot air it blew up over the top of me when it went by all right where is the rest area <laughs> do you see it <laughs> God, i don't even see it you see the trucks driving on the road uh it's right there so we're going to get down onto this next little road which is also closed except the local traffic and there's a road that cuts out this way goes way way across so we should be able to get pretty close to it may have to walk a little ways all right let's get back to it we see those little signs like that so you can you can drive on this and it goes out across there and the rest area is over there not too far so we'll get as close as we can and then we'll jump off the bike and just hoof it across and check out the uh, sides of the highway almost there this is actually private land right there and it's for sale <laughs> All right, so I have plenty of water. Well, I have three more waters, so we're good for another couple hours. It's so about two o'clock. I'm going to have a uh, late lunch. And today we are going to enjoy, and I've already started, um, sliced pears. Great value. And, um, well, it doesn't say made in China, so <laughs> I'm happy about that. But it does have one thing that's weird on here. Non-intent BPA non-intent so that means that they didn't intend to have bpa in there but there probably is because i'd rather say no bpas <laughs> i'm not sure what bpas are 